Welcome back to EKG. This is Cloudy. And this is EJX. Oh my god, she was just like looking up like, look at all the stars. Life <laughs> is amazing. Anyway, we're playing Wind Waker, Winkle Edition. After this, I'm probably, we're probably going to switch to a different game. I've been like looking up different things. This is one game called like, I think it's like one shot or like one something. Basically, you have one chance to beat the game. And if you die, the whole world resets and it, uh. rem and it remembers. Uh, I, I love modes like that. It, but it's not it's not like a um it's not a roguelike it's more story based so like it's think undertale if like every time you died the game like was a little more cheeky instead of just certain events okay yeah so i'm excited i think it could be cool oh that was a mistake that was a mistake i made a mistake <laughs> mistakes were made um so what, what kind of game is it a third person like what no, it's, it's, yeah, it's like 2D art, um, side scrolling kind of shit, oh, but okay. it's more story based. Yeah. Gotcha. I, and it was like $5 on Steam, so I'm like, I think I might buy this. Hmm. That'd just be something new to try. Because take yeah. a little break, break from the Wind Waker. Oh, yeah, Fuck give it. it a shot. Yeah. Oh, man. Whoop, 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 whoop. Okay, no. Stop. Oh. Don't want to fucking, thank you. <laughs> yeah, line her up. Mm. Oh yeah. All right. Cool. Oh yeah. Fuck you. God, you just, 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 just piranha plants. I mean, there's the Deku things that have been in like every fucking Zelda game. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's very an ocarina, bud. Duh. Get it right. God, did you even beat that? Okay, so we can't grapple this, but we could grab the tail oh, my of that Ryan's dragon. Belt. Oh my god. Hey, really? Yeah. I mean, it looks a lot like it. The three, like, big ones, just, like, right next to each other. I don't know the big dippers anywhere out there. Hey, look, it's a fucking... That looks like the little dipper. Yeah, big I think dipper. so. Did they, yeah, like, shit. put, like, yeah, actual console... I think they did. That's yeah, cool. That's the handle. Damn, that's sick. Fucking Wind Waker out here. It's a fucking right. GameCube game from, like, 2003, 4, 2... One of those. It could be the mod, too. No, I don't think so. Because I remember the sky in the game. I just never looked up that fucking in-depth. I wasn't, like... Oh, God. Fuck. <laughs> I knew that was going to happen. It's going to toss those agabies at you. Mr. Octopus. Mr. Cocktopus. More like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my. Are you just Mr. Krabs now? <laughs> the dabs were the crabs. <laughs> we labbed along the way. <laughs> It's oh sad. Oh my god, I love it, that. It's sad, but not mad. The things I have to say. Oh my god, it's fire! Oh my god, just someone sign me to a record deal right now. Jesus. So, my mic is literally burning. Yeah, it's cool, the, cool him off. <laughs> fucking somebody douse me. I'm fucking. <laughs> I don't remember what I said. I'll have to go back. Fucking. <laughs> the crabs were the tabs we laughed along the way. That we laughed along the way. It's sad. Something. It's sad. Not mad. The things I've got to say. That's true poetry. It's fucking. <laughs> I went to a slam poetry thing and did that and got signed to six record deals and told them all no. <laughs> because Cause yeah, because you're not. You don't go mainstream. I'm not mainstream. You're, you're indie. Yeah, I do the rapping for the people, not for the money. Oh yeah. Fucking. And when they told me I could get signed to a rap deal, I spit in their face. I'm like, I am a poet, and you will address, <laughs> you will address me as such. I have an artist, damn it. Art is dead. I fucking love Bo Burnham. Do you yeah, like Bo I know Burnham? You do. Yeah, I I haven't seen a lot of his, or heard of a lot of his stuff, but like from what the stuff I have seen, I like. You should uh, like watch his stand up because a lot of people say like he's got this like I don't know. It's like. <sighs> As someone who likes Carlin, I could I know that Carlin would probably hate him, but like also like I, I enjoy them both, so I don't know. I know you're like a really big Carlin fan. Yeah, but I mean I like a lot of different styles of comedians. That's, that's fair. What? Is this a thing? No? Like okay. I lo I love George Carlin, but I I love Seinfeld too, but George Carlin was probably not a big Jerry Seinfeld fan. Yeah. Was that one comic you really love that died? But like, he wasn't really even a comic. Bill, He's Bill Hicks. Bill Hicks, yeah. He's but no, he no, he was a comic. He just wasn't super big in the U.S. until like his last couple of years he was alive. He was mainly big in the U.K. Mainly because he talked shit about the U.S. way more than people did at the time. So he never really broke mainstream. Uh, 
the fuck? But yeah, no, I love Bill Hicks. He's a fucking man. What's going on in this room? <gasps> fucking. Fucking someone's like smoking opium. <laughs> or like yeah. dropping acid. Yeah, I feel like there's some uh, Alice of Wonderland shit going on in there, and I ain't about it. <laughs> Come trip the light, <clears throat> fantastic. Oh my, that tree has a dumb face. Speaking of DSL, you. Ugh, no, he's got an outbreak. Don't go near him. Is that Shrek? <laughs> it might be. <laughs> Somebody. Some. Dude, fucking. <laughs> no, made me think of this. But maybe just because Guy Fieri and uh, fucking Smash Mouth Guy are like the same people. But fucking not. Uh, so I always used to like think Guy Fieri was just the biggest douche and I hated him. But like lately, I think he might be like the greatest person alive. Really? Just because he, he like knows he's such a meme, but he's also like the most wholesome dude. Like he's always, anytime there's like a disaster or some shit, he's always like showing up and like cooking food for like the first responders and all that shit. Like he's actually like a, like a good dude. And he's like, he, he knows he's like a meme at this point, so he just takes it in stride and fucking just rolls with it. Can I hit these things? Okay, so that's not the answer. Huh. Yeah, I don't, I don't think you're supposed to clear up his STD outbreaks. Well, you are. Oh, you are? Yeah, you're supposed to knock these things off him, but like... Ugh. Oh, I have to... Oh. Okay. I didn't think rolling, a little girl could roll into the back of a tree and fucking... Yeah, fucking rumble the entire thing. Yeah. Ugh, oh. this thing's gross! Ugh! Ah! Kill it! Dude, I don't care right now. Green chew jelly. I would not be touching that. Apparently, if you mix it with shit, it'll make magic potion. Yeah, what else say? He's like, hey, I know you're trying to pick up that. What the? Don't care. Oh, I didn't do it fast enough. Okay. Sorry. Get the one. Yeah, it's like, donkey, help me. And I'm like, <laughs> I am a. I am not a donkey. Well, that I, was I'm not a, a real boy. <laughs> I'm a real dragon fucking boy. Donkey, fuck the dragon. <laughs> Talk about that for a second. Fucking, if I told you about like the, I can't remember where I heard it from. It was on a podcast or something, but someone had like a, a Reddit thing talking about how it was like something just about weird fetishes that people have from watching like old, like either Disney shit or like old cartoons. Yeah. Well, and like, apparently, you'll... apparently there's a fucking decent sized subset of people who are like erotically turned on or like have a fetish from like the Pinocchio scene of like the kid like growing like a tail out of his pants. What? <laughs> that is the proper response. <laughs> I, um, I have been around the internet for a while now. Oh god. I'm closer to 30 than 20 now. Oh Jesus Christ. I am uh, I'm a man. I'm a man <laughs> who has lived a long, long life on the internet. Oh, God. It, it takes something very special to make me go, <laughs> What? Wait, wait, what? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, that's a thing. <laughs> oh, and I think it was uh, related to, like, the, uh, what was it, Jumanji, where the kid, like, starts turning into a monkey, and they have to, like, rip a hole in his pants so his tail can come out. <laughs> See, I... Okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. Let me rewind for a quick second. <laughs> so when you said there was a fetish, and we were talking about Donkey fucking the dragon, I was like, okay, yeah, he's going to bring up, like, dragon dildos. You know, some people just, like, just destroying every hole in their body with these giant things. I'm like, okay, I don't get it personally, but hey, <laughs> do you? I thought oh, we were yeah. going to talk about that. You know, have a nice normal fetish conversation. <laughs> And you tell me that people are sexually aroused by the thought of turning little, in little boys growing tails out of their pants. Like, no, not it's not them. It's the fact that it happens. Wait, what? Yeah. <clears throat> Hold on. So it's or not it, the ba basically of anything like turning into an animal and popping a tail out of their pants. That sexually arouses them. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a thing. You know what? No. <laughs> I'm done. You know what? No. <laughs> No internet. I should. Keep, the internet, I like, the internet knows no bounds. I, no, stop it. 
and it's from the sea with Pinocchio. See, okay. <clears throat> Lola Bunny makes sense because they wrote her to be overly sexual. So when little boys were having all the fucking synopsis in their brain firing off and shit, it made sense that some people were like, oh, I kind of want to fuck bunnies now. Oh, totally. Like, again, not my cup of tea. but like, not, it, not bunnies, but humanoid bunnies. Yeah, that's, yeah. Um, and I get why that happened. And then, like, Jeff's go rabbit. Hey, man, I like big titty redheads. It might be, <laughs> it might be her fault. <laughs> or, you know, some people like anime porn because of Jessica Rabbit. They're like, oh, cartoons could be sexy too. What? Or Cause any she was, anime. Because she was written to be like that. I'm just talking about the shit you were exposed to when you were a kid. But oh, what yeah. in the fucking Pinocchio scene makes people go, yeah, this is also <laughs> making my dick hard? <laughs> what? Or or what? One of the two. I, I think girls are new at two. I don't know. I think it's just the action of something popping out of pants. Because it's like a backwards dick, maybe. But I don't know. Either way, I don't get it. But whatever. Speaking of the forbidden, <laughs> speaking of the forbidden woods. <laughs> yeah, this belongs in the forbidden woods. Yeah, this this convers this episode belongs in the forbidden woods. <laughs> So is this guy over his outbreak yet? Yeah. People are going to fly through the air. Oh, yes. Thank you, child. You're right. It's not bad for that. Why? Like, it's like, why does everyone have the same voice? I, go, I would guess. <laughs> I was going to say, this guy sounds happier than my like the boat. Whoa, the she just called, he just called us fat. Linkle, I would guess from your size that you are happier than my core children. Wow. I mean, I mean, you did knock off his, like, freaking outbreak by rolling into his back. Oh, my. Is he cooming right now? Oh. Like, oh! I'm having one. You're going to make me have two. Oh, oh my. That, that was those were his. Face. Those were his vinegar strokes. <laughs> that was an old face if I've seen one. Fucking Christ. Forgive dude. me, Linkle. I just had one in my pants. Uh, I had one all over the roots. So now, anytime you step in the water on this island, like you are right now, remember. I mean, in a way, when you're walking through the woods, you're kind of just surrounded by plant jizz. It's kind, kind of what pollen is. You know, I thought you were about to be like, that. you know, and that's kind of hot. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, legit, mean, I mean, I'm into it. <laughs> I legit thought that, would, like, my brain put that as what you said next. Like, you know, when you're walking through the forest, there's a lot of fucking uh, plant... Po like jizz, and that's ba like pollen is basically jizz. You know, that's kind of hot. <laughs> I, <was> like, <laughs> I mean, I mean, in your defense, I've said weirder things, so it, it wouldn't be out out of the realm of possibility. Yeah, but like it should be, you know. <laughs> it should. I mean, at least I didn't say it, or did I? Or at least you weren't thinking it. He says. Well, or was I? Throwing away notes he had scraped down in the last three seconds about what you're about to say next. I don't know how I'd to get up a. I don't know how to get up on this tree. I wasn't listening, so we could do I'd it be, next. Time. I'd be fairly, like, confident that there are people out there that are turned on by plant pollen. <laughs> Hopefully, no one with allergies. Cause that's a that's a bad fetish I have. Her face <laughs> is my reaction to you right now. <laughs> Just not when the mouth open, the mouth closed face. Yeah, like, like, she doesn't yes. have a nose, so she looks like a, almost like a South Park character right now. I know, right? Come on down to South Park, give ourselves a time. Oh, all right, I'm fucking done. Join us <laughs> next time, Jesus Christ. See you later.